To begin understanding the post office scandal, we need to go back in time. <laughs> Thank you, Doctor Who. We're going to go back to the invention of post as we know it. Well, when was post invented? The, the invention of post. It was first invented by the Assyrians. <laughs> You've got a problem with that. The Assyrians. Yeah. <laughs> well, they're also Tit-Syrians. They <laughs> 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 willfully misconstrued the naming convention of ancient civilizations. The Assyrians lived in Assyria. Was that in the ass end of nowhere? It was. <laughs> um, they developed the very first postal system. They developed it as a relay. Relay, that's what I said. Yeah. Let me demonstrate. You be the postal delivery person, the righty ho. And here is your letter. Imagine it. Okay, I've got a letter here. Now, saddle up and drive for a day. Oh, just go and get an ass. You, 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 you. I, amazingly, somebody thinks they've got a prop for an ass down there. Where would. Well, that's the best you can do. That's the best I can do. Right, saddle up on your ass. I am on my ass right now. And here's your letter. Ride. No, you ride. Ride for a day. Right, I'm riding for a day. Clippity clop, clippity clop, clippity clop. And then at the next service station, woo, now you hand over the letter to the next guy, and he rides off and finishes the delivery. Fare thee well, next guy. And the letter reaches its destination, and you wait there for the reply, and then you go back to the capital of Assyria with the reply. Where's the capital of Assyria? I don't know, ask Damascus, it doesn't matter. <laughs> then, then came an advancement on the postal system. Did they advance upon it by making it funny this time? No, they didn't. <laughs> it's a bit of history for you, it's a bit of history here. You're having fun keeping that dog from falling. I am that than the greatest fun in very <laughs> Stay there, Neddy. You may have another journey. He, Neddy does, in fact, have another journey ahead. For then came the Romans. The Romans, yeah. And the Romans had a different system of posting the mail, did they? Yeah. Take this scroll. What, what's this scroll made of? Papyrus. Is that the stuff you can put in the dishwasher? It is. Take this vital scroll. I think you've worked out the average age of the audience there. <laughs> Take this vital scroll of important information. Ride until you get to Rome. Are we not already in Rome? No, no, no. Your journey with your scroll begins in the farthest from flinging of the Roman Empire. Rat eye. Same to you, knob features. No. <laughs> Rat eye is the Roman name for Leicester. As you all knew, did you not? Yes. Just checking. <laughs> Sorry, what was that? Of course. Of course. Good, that's what we like, a little bit of confirmation and a little bit of patronising. <laughs> <laughs> so right now, right now, from here in Jury Wall Museum, just below street level, you'll have to get your horse up some stairs, and then, <laughs> then round the Holiday Inn roundabout, then ride to Rome. Yes, I shall. Clippity clop, clippity clop, clip. Oh, I have ridden for a whole day. I have reached the far, far distant southern climes of Czech signpost. Market Harbour. <laughs> now I can hand over to the next guy. Ah, but that is not the method of the Roman Postal Service, is it not? No. You get a new horse. Hooray! We haven't got another prop for a horse. I've got another prop for a horse. Amazingly, somebody's got another prop for a horse. There were no horses in the shop. There weren't many, no. Okay. So, get it back on your second horse, because it is one message and one messenger all the way to Rome. Oh, you bugger. Clip it to clock, clip it to clock, clip it to clock. Many weeks passed until finally, hi, honey, I'm in Rome. Now you must deliver your vitally important letter. Um, okay, um, horsey, away. Um, do you know where Centurion Maximus Decimus, named for Masterix Bucius, is? We shall just fetch him. Hello! Hello! I am Centurion Maximus Decimus, named for Maxius Bucius. Are you Deliverus Postius Office? I am. Do you have the scrolls? No, it's just the way I walk. <laughs> First laugh of the day, and it happens to come from the two Ronnies. Right, what was it? <laughs> Let me read my message. You, uh, uh, just, just fetch my message. Give him, uh, unfurl my message. I'm unfurling it. I'm unfurling it. Okay, and let's have a look at that message there then. <laughs> With your four hands. I've got four hands. Yes, I have. <laughs> Let me read my message. Uh, I'll just be getting along. No, no, you stay there. Oh, right here, oh yeah, I suppose I am angling for a tip. I'm reading what it says. Veni vidi vici, 
Habeas Corpus, Caveat Emptor, Dilce Deforum Est, MCMLXXXVIII, Quadrat Demonstrandum. So, what is the reply? The reply is this. Stab, 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 st